Hey everyone, and welcome back to Shadows of the Dam. We are in the underworld, and right where we left off, we were in front of this thing they're calling a sushi lamp. Let's see what it does. <laughs> and of course, interesting uh, music to say the least. Because uh, Shadows of the Dam, that's what this game does. Oh, back up, back up, back up. Oh, there you go. Just wanted to make sure they could all get killed by that shot. <laughs> What this thing does is it lights your path, it uh, provides light that hurts enemies, or at least keeps enemies at bay, and uh, it's very useful. Unfortunately, it's kind of slow, but I wouldn't like it if it was really fast either. So, so there's that. A cemetery. Really? I had no idea. No, there isn't. No need to get snippy. It's just this wasn't here before. Since when do demons get buried? Since I came to town. Her to her to her. You're such a hard ass. Oh, don't need any more ammo there. So... Whoa, who did this? Mr. X! Only a demon hunter could kill this many and not be lying dead next to them. Oh, well, maybe there's uh, there's another demon hunter in hell then. I promised we would be buried together. I don't know, we'll see as the game progresses. But, uh, what is... is this an open grave? Oh god. Aim for the head! Not that you really have a choice. No, the head would be wrong, friend. Shoot the red spots. Yes, that'd be right. Oh god, enemies. Hmm. I have to decide whether I want to kill them or just focus on this guy. And I think I am just gonna focus on this guy, because from what I recall, enemies just respawn here. Get as many shots off as I can. Oh, there we go. Don't want to get damaged. Get the fuck out of my way. There. Sweet. One of them is gone already. That was quick. Uh, War of Attrition. There we are. Oh. Didn't want to turn around like that. But when you have clunky controls like this, sometimes you can't... You can't... Con can't determine exactly where you're going to be at all times. Or what your character's going to do perfectly. Come on, dude. There. Sweet. That was quick. Ooh, gems. Yeah, what the fuck do you want? Didn't need to reload there, but uh, no harm. Uh, I was gonna try to get the headshot thing again, but uh, uh, I, just, I just, just said fuck it. And there's a whole bunch more uh, ammo over here, so that's why I was so uh, so wasteful there. Or maybe I was just wasteful because I don't give a fuck. Either way, either way works for me. Is that long tower? I don't even remember. Oh well, we will see as we move along. And it seems like we are at the end of this level. Generally, levels will end with big doors like this, sometimes with events, but other times with just big ass doors that we have to uh to wrangle open. Alright, and we are back in another level of Shadows of the Damned. I almost said Dante's Inferno there. That wouldn't be correct. Where is a gold when you need one? Okay, okay. Crazy idea, G. What if we use that chandelier? Oh, uh, that's not crazy. So, all we have to do is just use this to uh, haphazardly swing around and, uh... And, and, and mash all these, uh, these darkness, uh, I guess, uh, orbs. So that we get the darkness away from us, and we can uh, we can move up. There you go. Easy enough. 
And there are a whole shitload of white gems to collect in here, which is A-OK -okay by me, because you can never use enough of those. Or never have too many, I should say. Ah, oh, damn it, I missed it. Seems like I have to swing a little bit higher than I, I was. Or a little bit lower, maybe? There we go. There's that one. And that one. And just one more. Sweet. But I want to make sure I get all the white gems I can, because the more white gems, the more red gems I can get, and the more red gems, the more power-ups. The more power-ups, the less likely I am to die, and, and I can kill enemies faster, and all sorts of fun shit like that. So, gotta get as many as I can. So, let's just swing around here so we can get shit. Are there enemies on the walls, too? I didn't even know that they were there. But, doesn't matter. They can't hurt me right now. I guess they're just another source of uh, white gems and stuff. Oh, yep, you're dead. Oh, did not even see that just thing. Me, or these crystals a bit phallic? <laughs> you're one to talk. The crystals are not phallic, Johnson. Jesus Christ! You see, chandelier, brilliant idea for one you pulled out of your ass. Wrong. I don't have an ass. Hurdy, hurdy, hur. Before we go through the door, let's uh, let's upgrade just a little bit more. And, uh, uh, why not, uh, let's give it to the Teether. Let's give the Teether a bit more damage. Well, that was fast. And, uh, I just used this time to talk to you guys for a bit. Uh, the, uh, the reason why I upgraded the Teether there is because, um, I mean, instead of the boner, which is what I would normally do, is just because uh, it's it's a it's a weapon that I'm I, I I think I undervalue it in certain ways. It's much more useful than I say it is, um, just because it fires so quickly, it can hold enemies back, and hell, why not kill them a little faster too? And later on, the teeth will become, I in my opinion, the best weapon in the game. Uh, but that's not for a little while. Gotta get some more upgrades first. Alright, seems like there may be something up this path. Oh, that just seems like it's ammo that I can't get because I'm full on ammo. Uh, at least with the with the boner I am. Oh, and I don't think I've ever explained the difference between the kinds of drinks. Uh, there, the sake is, or sake, what, however you pronounce it, is the uh, the weakest of the drinks. It doesn't heal you as much as uh, the tequila does. Um, and even but stronger than the tequila is the absinthe, which will heal you for a whole shitload. Um, but first, let's uh, let's see. Do we have enough for for Christopher here? Is there? Is there anything hidden around here? Because sometimes, you never know, red gems can be hidden anywhere. And unless you walk up close to them, you'll never get them. Alright, seems like there's not. How'd you two get here so fast? Y'all rode the chandelier, didn't you? Yes, I rode the chandelier. And, uh, that's all I really want from you, Chris. Now that we have another upgrade, uh, let's go ahead and uh, and help the the teeth are out uh, once more. Um, we'll go damage again. There we are. The uh, reload speed and capacity are also very good, but those are things that I I, I consider later. It sounds like a cat having sex with a harmonica, and not the consensual kind. Hey, every demon has the right to pick the music for his own funeral. Uh, 
Okay, the excrement is really hitting the proverbial fan here, G. I'm what you might call concerned. Me too. Concerned this kill is gonna be over too quickly. Might I suggest we not just stand here? Before you die, demon scum, I will carve my name into your flesh. That name is Garcia Hotspur, hunter of demons and slayer of cameroons like you! So if you're thinking, uh, what the fuck right now, you, you got it right. <laughs> because honestly, what the fuck. Yeah, he just shat out darkness, in case you were wondering. There we go. And his weak spots exposed just like that. That easy. Rinse, lather, repeat, my friends. Rinse, lather, repeat. Oh, just gotta, just gotta hit him until he shoots that out, and then dodge. Really simple ship. There's a reason why I said this game didn't give me all too much trouble, because it's really not that hard. The, uh... Oh, oh, we're as... Of course, just as I say that. Damn it, damn it, damn it. I think I may actually want to switch to the teether for this one. It seems like there's a lot of teether ammo lying around. Um, there we go. Get some more. Um, and, uh, just kinda, just gotta, <laughs> gotta wait for this guy to shit out some darkness, just like that. Then we can, uh, run to it and, and hit him and knock him, knock him right down. Oh, crap. Uh, this darkness thing will slowly expand until we get him. Sit on the ground. What are you, what? Are you, are you fucking shitting me? Ah, uh, damn it. Darkness is hurting. Uh, oh, he shout out some more darkness for us. There we go. Gotta make sure I'm actually hitting this thing, and you know that you're hitting it if, if uh, like, redness is flying out as you're hitting it. Uh, if there's no redness flying out, then you are missing and wasting your time. Oh. Yeah, so... Um, I didn't hit him enough last time, clearly, because if I did, then he would have, uh, dropped down just like he just did. But, uh, you know, because it didn't, it, it, he did nothing before. I guess, uh, I just didn't hit him enough times with the, uh, with the boner. Are you gonna shout, it, shout out some stuff? Gonna shoot something out? There you go. Come on, get, get down. Or, or at least get hurt enough. There we go. Uh, get more ammo because I'm just chewing through this teether ammo right here. And now we have five things to fly at us, which means I have to dodge roll twice. Again, still fucking easy. At least easy for a hard mode battle. Oh. <laughs> Seems like the teether is certainly the way to go on this guy. Uh, using the other weapon just doesn't seem to do the trick. And by other weapon, I mean the boner. Can I shoot out some darkness, friend? Or not? Just gonna ground. Yep, ground pound. All right. There we go. Ah, uh, before I do this, gotta get some more more ammo. Oh fuck. Damn it, probably should have gotten Yep, should have gotten ammo first. Oh, crap, crap, crap. But as always, for everything in this game, the way to dodge it is just dodge roll. Nothing special, nothing fancy, just dodge roll. Crap. Oh jeez, jeez, jeez. Come on, get the fuck down. Damn it. That's my fault. Switch back to the boner. Don't have much health left on the teether. 
and I don't want to run out. Even though I, I could go get some right now. I guess he's not shitting out some darkness. Might as well. Uh, there we go. And as I've said before, or just said more so, this, uh, the, 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 the whole point of this game is not that it's difficult. It's not that uh, it's, uh, it's going to be a big challenge for you. At least I hope it's not. Because uh, <laughs> if it is, then you may, uh, may not be the best gamer. Not like not that you actually have to be good at, at video games because they're just they're supposed to be fun. But um, the point of this of this game is not it's just it's not challenging. It's, it's to provide a unique experience. Or at least that's the way I take it. But uh, I may be in the minority. Come on, God, God damn it! He's not not sitting in one spot or making it easy for me to hit him at all. Come on, guy. Okay. Really. There we go. Fucking A. Hopefully, I'm able to do enough damage to knock him down and kill this motherfucker. Let's go. <laughs> That's all it took.